of silence permeates the air. What did I miss? Bursting onto the London theatre scene is Wajahat Ali's new play, The Domestic Crusaders. Set in America, it focuses on a day in the life of a modern Muslim Pakistani American family. The play debuted in New York last year and received widespread accolades and reviews. At the time, Wajahat told us it's a universal story of a family that's told through a culturally specific lens. The eldest is the grandfather Hakim, a retired Pakistani general, living with his Pakistani immigrant son Salman, who is a successful engineer who has made the American dream but with significant costs. His wife, Kulsum, and their three American born children the eldest, Salahuddin, the middle, Fatima, who just started wearing the hijab, and the youngest, Ghafoor, who, who today has turned 21, and to celebrate his 21st birthday, the six diverse members of the same family have convened, some of them against their will, uh, to eat biryani. Just couldn't sleep last night. Jet lag. Some work I had to do, usual yeah. stuff. PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, Wii. What is this? You put Velcro on your face? Now the play has crossed the Atlantic and is being staged at Tara Theatre in South London for three weeks only. Directed by the theatre's artistic director, the Domestic Crusaders is set to take a British audience on an evening, showcasing the sparks that fly among three generations. It all culminates in a great family battle, as each character, or crusader, struggles to impose their opinions while trying to keep the family united. Ahead of opening night, we joined the actors for a special Living the Life Only staging. And afterwards, they told us they were nervous about playwright Wajahat Ali sitting in the audience for the premiere. He does it in a comic way. So you know, the points are told, but they're done with a lightheartedness as well. It's dark comedy, yeah. you know. Uh, it kind of seeps in your head. It's your interpretation of it as, mm -hmm. as you would read a book. I hope we can do his work justice. Yeah. I, re I really hope we can do the work justice. Um, yeah. I think if, nice. uh, for any writer, I think if, you, if he can get the words off the page and make his words sing. And make them real. Yeah. And I think... If possible. Possible. And then we'll talk to him afterwards. Wajahat Ali, who travelled to the UK for the launch, explained to us that the creativity behind the domestic crusaders came about like from pain. Uh, you know, this, this global microscope that was placed under Muslims, this global scrutiny, this pain that you mentioned, inspired or perhaps provoked uh, as a necessity the, uh, a call for art and expression. And uh, I think as a result, it means people who felt marginalized, sometimes victimized, sometimes silenced, sometimes the sidekick of the story, sometimes a footnote, sometimes as the global antagonist, they felt like, you know, who is telling our story? You know, our story is being told to us by others. And in the story, we're not the protagonist of our own narratives. We're either completely forgotten or the antagonists. And I think storytelling and art is a way to bridge the divides and perhaps heal the wounds, um, both within the community. And I think stories, like I always said last time, that stories are now by us but for everyone. The Domestic Crusaders is at the Tara Theatre until the 11th of October.